had an idea to make the accordion pocketbook, you know, that accordion bag that I've just done, to make it a pocketbook. So we're going to give that a try, but I want to put a heart on it. So I think this right here is really cool looking. Don't you? So I think we need to go with this. Okay? But we need a template, and we want it bigger. Because this is going to go on a pocketbook. So, here we have it bigger. All these pins are just holding it. This is a t-shirt material. So, the t-shirt material won't work on what we're doing. But the cotton will. So, here is the... Um, what I did for the uh, pattern, okay? Ain't it cool? I said I'm gonna keep that one, but we're gonna have to make another one because you can't use that one. So I'm gonna show you how to make it. Okay, so I'll be back in a minute. All right, I made this one last night, so let's see if I can remember how to make it. All right, now I have two pieces of plastic. Now, this plastic came out of the bacon. You know, you, you get them with the bacon laying on them. I just washed them, and I save them for stuff like this or, you know. So, you, and believe it or not, I'm out now, and I've got to make some more, get some more, and all. So, I'm going to start saving them all over again. All right, let's get started on this. Now, what I want to do, I want to make sure they're together and I'm going to pin to just two of the sides to where that it don't move on me. Okay, let's do it up here at the top so it don't get in my way as I'm working down there. Alright, now we're going to circle and what we're going to do is put the circle up here at the top as close as we can to the top and then we're going to just make that circle all the way around. Ta -da! Yay! We made a circle. <laughs> okay. Now, then on this right here, we want to go put this down and make it just as level as we can. So I'm taking a line on the ruler and put it down here on the line on the paper because I meant the car, uh, plastic because we know this right here is a computer crap. The job took it away. <laughs> okay, so we're going to take us a line and draw it straight down from the circle. And we're going to come over here and we're going to do the same identical thing. Just put your line down here and then find where your uh, circle is right here. And that it'll reach all the way down to that line. And this is an 8 inch ruler. But you all should recognize it. Alright, then we're going to draw us another line. Now, we want to know how much is here. So there's 4 inches here. Right, we're going to scoot this down to the bottom. We have 4 inches. Every inch. 1, 2, 3, and we got the 4. So now we want to turn it around this way, and we want to go four inches up, okay? And then we're going to mark the four inches. Yeah, four inches. We'll mark the four inches. Come right here. Mark the other four inches. Mark this four inches. Uh oh, I'm not doing. Okay, I'm going by the line. Four inches down. Alright. Now, this top is too big. Way too big. So, what we need to do is take this uh, circle that we have up here and we want to cut it in half. From line to line and cut it in half. I'll make sure I'm right. Yes, I'm right. Yay. Now, all right. So now from he down here to down this way, we want to cut right here. Now, unfortunately, we're going to have to go up more on this. 
So let's get this right here down. Because I'm trying to remember as, uh, what I did last night. Alright, right there. Right there's our line. Now, we are going to take and cut this off. Alright, straight across. Yeah, I did this last night, and I think I forgot some of it. There we go. Now, we can go out and trash. That ain't no good. Now is when we need to go to four inches up. So let's put our, more, our ruler back on here, and it'll be what? Look, right at that line. Okay, so far, you have got something wrong, but you are making it up. Alright, let's give that ink a minute to dry. As you can tell, it's kind of like, you know, smears and Alright, so I'm gonna, I'm going to use this red, but now, what I want to do is, I'm only going to make one, just one piece, okay, one, one of them, just not to make one heart. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to use this side and the back side for the heart, so, Let's see if we can cut that bad baby out now. We want to kind of keep it together. Ah! It twisted on me. Oh, mama. Alright, let me... I should have stuck a pin in it. Right there. Let me see if I can't get that line back up. I'm going to stick a pin over here in this corner. Y'all pin it down. Don't do like me. See, I cut my pins off. No, it won't hold there. <laughs> okay. Enough of the bone now. It ain't going to do you no good. Okay. There we go. Now, let me go out of the way. I think I got it. Now, we want to cut all the way up to that line. Right there. And you're in my way and I don't want to get rid of you. Cut it to the line. Now, let's see how well we done. Now, this is how you can tell if you've done it. Right up here where all your little snip marks, just lay it, like this one right here, up to it. And I think I did a good job. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So now we have two of these. We only need one. <laughs> but I'm going to put it together and do like I did the other one. Like this one. I'm going to put it together like that. <clears throat> okay. So, what we want to do is we want to take this, turn it over. <clears throat> Looks to me like that's all we need right there. Alright. Let's cut this down. I don't know what all this stuff is all over. That's alright. I'm still going to use it. Now, I'm going to pin this bad baby down again. Cut it out. Yeah, I got ink all over my fingers. You want to make sure you put a uh, pin all these down because you're going to have different cut marks in there. And you don't need them flopping on you. I guess y'all seen what happened there. Oh. Alright, here we go. Man, these are here pretty good pair of scissors. I didn't know I had such a good pair of scissors that are nothing but for paper. But these right here seem like they're good scissors. 
just gonna keep on going. Oh, wrong. <laughs> All right. Let's put that little piece with that piece. Because I can use it. Maybe something later. Okay. Now, let's cut these right here out in between all the way to the line. Make sure you got both of them. right here is the way my heart is going to look. Okay. Now, let's weave this bad baby down. The first, that, the second one you want to turn up and the last one you want to turn up. You want to lay this one down. You want to turn the second one up and the last one up. You want to take this one Put it here. You want to scoot it down all the way. Put this one right here all the way up against that top there. And I want these so I can iron it. And then we're going to pin it. Make sure you try to keep it flat so when we iron it. Now we want to take this one right here and we're going to go all the way down here. And we want to try to make sure it's all the way up against the, the lining here on this side. Because if we don't keep it straight, then when we uh, get to the last one, it won't fit it right. So we may have to do some adjusting and figuring out and fixing it as we go. <coughs> okay. So. Now then, we want the first one up, and then the third one up, okay? Then we want to lay this one down, all the way across, pin it right here, scoot that over, I want all of this line, like that, make sure it's flat, lay that one down, Get out of my way. Then lay that one down. Okay. There we go. So far, so good. Let's see if I can't get that out of my way first. There we go. Alrighty. Now then the next one. Uh, it goes down. This one goes up, this one goes down, this one goes under. So let's straighten it out. So this one all the way right here. Give it a pin down. There we go. Alright, now we've got our last one. Okay, now this is what I'm sh what I'm talking about. We don't want that. That looks crubby. So, what we're going to do is take it apart. Sorry about your luck. Let's take that one out. We're not going to take it all the way, all the way apart. Okay, so we got that. So, let's see if we can't use a little snippers here. And we want to go up right here. Just a little bit on every one of them. Because you don't need much. Okay. So let's take this one out. And let's scoot. Scoot this one up. And 
pin it down. I don't want to show. There we go. There we go. Now let's see. If we can't scoot. Let's flatten that one out. Scoot it up. Flatten that one out. Whew. Okay. Let's put that. Okay, now we're all the way up here at the top. Let's pin that one down. Let's push. 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 <laughs> it's supposed to be pull, okay? All right, let's see how close we are now to being done. So let's get this right here lined up down here. Give it a pin down. All right, now this one goes on top. Let's put it, pin it down. We're going to get this one, line it up, and make a merry-go-round. Uh, there we go. And then we're going to do this one the same identical way, line it up, pin it down. Now, we did this one. Now we've got to do this one. So according to this one, all we have to do just go just a little bit on it and it should work itself out. Now we'll play with it. Alright, now I don't like the way this one is. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now let's turn it over. Let's scoot this one right here over. Flat. All right, I'm trying to keep all my pins on one side so they're easier to manage. All righty, I think we can live with that. I really, really do. All righty, we'll be back. Okay, I want to give you a um, update on the bell. Uh, sewing I've been doing. I've been working on them, but my mother's aunt uh, called me and asked me to do her a favor. So I put it aside, and I'm working on what she asked me to work for. And it's a, a beautiful owl. And I'm still working on it, but this is how far I've gotten with it. Let's see if you can... Yeah, I can get a little bit closer. Ain't that working out pretty? But I have been working on this, and it is for her grandson, and all. So, that's what's going on, but I am working on them. I have not forgot them. I don't know if you all have, but I haven't. Okay, I have me uh, that fusible web stuff. Now, we got our pins on this side. We don't want that, so we want this side. And now, they're going to stick to the pins. But... You know what? I don't care. Alright. So what we're going to do is we're going to iron it down. Like that. Now the pins are going to be hot. How much did I get stuck to the table? A whole bunch of it. Shame on you, Sandy. I thought you had enough more sense than that. Ouch, I touched the pen. That's okay, we get it off. We're gonna go on. I'm just crazy that way. Yeah. Let's check this out. Bet you can't do that with your eye anymore. <laughs> we still got some there. 
I don't think that's going to come off. There it goes. Okay. <coughs> now then. Let's see if we can't take these pins off. I think that I gave it enough time to cool down while I played. <laughs> Now, what we want to do now is we want to go and sew all the way around it. So, I'm going to go do that. Alright, now let's cut this bad baby out. As close as you can. Don't worry if you cut some of the some of the heart, it ain't gonna hurt nothing. Alright, now we throw that away. Alright, now the next thing we wanna do is we wanna take this one and peel the paper off first. I think that one might help you just a little bit on it. I'm not for sure. Uh, let's put some marks in it so we can get it out easier. And then we're going to do this. And we're going to make a mess all over our table. I don't think you'll care, will you? You don't have to clean it up. And make sure we don't take off our stuff. I just pull some off right there. And I don't want to do that. Just be careful with it. Oh no. Oh, it don't want to. It wants to stay to the paper. If I can't do some scoring down here, that'll do any better. I don't know, I think that scoring may be a problem. Because it seems like it's coming looser where I scored it at. We may not want to do that no more. Alright, I'm going to get the rest of this off and then I'll be back. Alrighty, now then, I got me a piece of white here. This is what I'm going to use on the uh, for the pocket part. So now we're going to lay it down here, and I'm going to get rid of some of it because I don't need all of this. Okay, I just want to have enough to do what I need. Okay. If I keep this up, I'll have it all cut down. I don't have none left to do it. <laughs> Alright. Now, we want to pin this down. And we want to leave an opening. So, I suggest picking one of these sides, not down here. So, if I go right here. Get in there. And right here. For my opening on there then I'm going to be pretty good because I want all make sure all this right here is uh, down and not you know going to be messed with so I suggest that we sew this down and we're going to go over and do it now so let's take us a turn and let's see we got to go down and we are, oh, 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 yes, I forgot. I'm going to remember, give me a minute, let's slide this down. There we go. Now let's see if we need to put you back up. Because we don't want you to have an earthquake this time. Alright, now, so far, so good. 
All right, now I'm going to start right here. <coughs> and what we want to do is back stitch. Okay, go to about two, three in. We want to turn and follow it around. And go right beside where, we're, where our stitch is or right on the stitch. If you could do it on a stitch, that would be great. But I am not that fortunate half the time. I have to go beside it on the inward side. I'm not that talented. Only in some spots. <laughs> Try it again. Ah, I want too many. Okay. Unfortunately for y'all to see me, I'm going to put you back up here. Turn you around. Ha! Oh, there you are back at your area. Now let's take these out. We're going to get rid of them. And then we are going to cut all the way around. Man, this is a lot of work just for a pocket. I think in the long run, we or I, however, is going to like it, and you guys will probably end up making one. And if you do, send me a picture. I can see what colors you use and all. <coughs> let's see. Let's do it this way. Trying to find the easiest way to cut it. Now you don't have to worry too much about your stitches and all. Just long I meant your edges. Just don't cut your stitches. There we go. That's what I'm trying to say. You're going to spit it out here in a minute, Sunday. And then we'll have it right. Because sometimes I just can't speak splain for spluttering. Okay. Let's get rid of our garbage. If we can. I don't want all that stuff in my way no more. Alright, let's turn this bad baby around. Da -da -da. Like this. Oh, I want to cut right here. On my little scissors. I'm afraid I'm going to cut too much. And I don't want to cut too much. There we go. Now, let's cut this through here tip off down here. There we go. Okay, where's my hoe? Oh, there it is. Alright, now we got more garbage on there. But that's okay. Let me go get my stick. Oh, the lacy come in with the stick. And... We're like, oh no. I thought she had gotten that when it fell on the floor or something. I didn't know it. <laughs> and she uh, she got a hold of it and started chewing it. Oh man, you talk about. Whew. I've seen that outside still. Like, yeah, good. I don't want her to have that one. Oh man, it's turning out cool looking. Yes. Now. Oh man, that's going to be a funny looking pocket, ain't it? Let's see if we can't get that up there. But that's going to be a cute little pocket. I mean, it's just a little tiny pocket. 
Ooh, I got some of that fiber stuff on my finger there. You see it right there? <laughs> okay. So, let's take and then try to manipulate this to go the way we want to without making any Oh, wrong pen. I want this pen. I want to make sure that when I do it with the iron, it doesn't kill anything. There we go, there we go, there we go. Alright, we've got that one to go. <laughs> Sometimes you've got to do what you've got to do. Ugh. <sighs> I think that's going to be close enough. Come on. These things are dull. <laughs> I think you know why. Okay. Now then. I think that looks good. I do. I wish this right here was bigger, but that's okay. We can we can live with that. All right. I wonder. Let me try this. Oh, I'm stuck on something. Let me try this before we do that. Now I want you back. And you're too far away. Right here. Just try to pull that out more. I don't even know if I use that thing or not. I could be going and getting it. <laughs> the video will tell. Alright. I think I like that better. Alright, here we go. Now, this right here is just to hold it together and all. Now... <clears throat> To give it our decorative look that we want, we want to sew from right. Now, let's see, where's our pocket going to be? Where's my ruler? I want this ruler right here. We want our pocket. Okay, right here is where that is. And let's put that right there. Scoot it up. Scoot it up. I think so. I think that's going to be it. We want to sew from right here. Maybe if we can get a pin in that. I don't know. No, so we can't get this back up here. Alright, there it is. Two right here. Alright, we want to sew all the way around this top stitch. Alright, now then, it is ready to go on the pocket book. Yes, I think it is, I think it is, and I'm happy with it. I think it looks really nice. Alrighty, so I'm going to take me a break, and I'm going to go get warm, and then we'll be back, and I'll show you the pocket book part, and what we got to do to it. Okay, now, the way that I did this is I laid it down on, I, I couldn't find no paper, so I got a dog food bag. So, that that works too. So, I took it and I laid it down about in the middle of my dog food bag here on the corner, and I pinned it down. My first ones you can't see, but I want this right here a little bit bigger. So I started with it, and I started way up here with it, and I went down this way and made myself go smaller, right down in here. And then I went around probably about a half an inch, maybe less. All right, then when I got this first one on, I removed it. I took my hand, so I can't get you a little bit closer, it's too close, no. All right, I took my hand, 
I laid my my knuckle right there. I hope you can see where I'm pointing at right there. On my first line. You know, on my line here. Not my first line, it's probably about my fourth line. And then I started marking it. Mark it down. And I just go right around and put my finger on there and mark it down. You know, just put me a little line all the way around. Uh, that's just to show you what I was doing. Okay. And then, if you notice, I did it again. I wanted this right here a little bit bigger. So I made it a little bit bigger right here. So that it would, you know, uh, be, be bigger the way I want it. So I'm hoping that this works. But we're going to find out. So now we're going to just cut out on our little dots that we have made. If you want to draw, connect the dots, go right on ahead. But I'm using my scissors to connect my dots. And I hope that it works. Let's see. Let's go this way. So now we have our pattern. So I'll be back in just a minute. All right. That was awful nice. I brought me some stove top cleaner. I got that glass stove top. I, I, that would not have been my choice. But it was in the house, and it was it's it's a brand new one. All right. So now then, now I don't know how well it's going to turn out, but we are really going to give it one heck of a try because I want to try it. Oh, I got pins in it. Yeah, I put, start putting pins in these because uh, you can't, um, it, it keeps on messing up. So before I lose my pins, it goes to these and we put them up. I have a little, I have a penny cushion over here. All right, my dog wants that. So <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm on the other side. This is the side that, it was easier to roll the bulk out. Okay, so now while I was letting him out, I cut this down and pinned this right here on. Now I left this up here. Now I want to make this bigger. So I'm going to show you how to do it now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my hand on this one right here. And I'm going to make me some lines that go up. Okay. Now right here, I'm going to put my hand right here on this one, and I'm going to start making my curve all the way up. Now, let's cut this bad baby out. Uh-oh. This pair of scissors is not good for this. Alright, now, I don't know the measurements through here, so we'll have to get those as we go when we get to it. So, here we go. <coughs> and there we are. Alright. Let's take all these pins out. Now I know I need straps. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this sit right here. I'm going to turn around here to this side. And I'm going to move you over there. And I'm going to get my rotary cutter. And my thing badoodler with the plexiglass there. Let's see if we can't get rid of some of this bulk here. Get rid of that. Now, 
right here. I want to try to make sure things level out here good enough. And I'm going to cut me one of these and open it up. Uh, it wouldn't. Not the ones that it didn't. See? <laughs> what it is, because you see all these are here marks right here. That's what causes my thread not to not to work. All right, let's turn this bad baby around. Yeah. Cut all that down. Now let's see if we got enough to make us a stripe. Most of definitely we have two of them, so we're lucky there. We're happy there. Ha ha ha. Alrighty. Now. Put that aside. And we're going to put this aside. And I'm going to cut me out, or fine, and cut me out some fiber fill. So that we will have it. So I will be back. Alrighty, unfortunately, I gotta use the uh, Harvey's quilt and the, the batting off of it. Alright, now, where do we want our opening? I think right here will do great for our opening. Okay. So now we're gonna start pinning it all the way around. And sewing it down. What if I have any yellow thread? I don't know. But I think I hope this turns out cool, and I hope it works. And you know, I, we'll find out when my brain gets there. Because <laughs> you know, most of this stuff, I just play with it as I go. And some of it I think of, and I can think of parts of it, and I'll, as I go, it turns out, it turns out better than I thought sometimes, which that's a shock. But I, I really love doing this. This is really, you know, and, and then I give the stuff away, and all people are like, you ought to sell it. Yeah, I, I if I could sell it, I would, but I can't get on the, uh, you know, the selling place thing. I mean, it let me set up an account, but then when you go back on it, it won't let me. All right, let's sew this all the way around. All right, I hope it turns out. I really do. And I hope I can get out this little opening. <laughs> all right, let's give it a wipe down. I hope it turns out. I mean, it's just going to be a small one. Looks like I might go a little bit closer on my fiber feel. I know I've got, I had to give myself some seam room because uh, the top one shift on me. So, it'll be alright. We're not beneath trying to work things off out and Hopefully, do it better. Do it good as we go. All right. Now, I want to snip here without cutting into my my seam. And trim it up some. As I can tell, it needs it. I don't want all this crap in there. I said we can't turn this way. Get some of it off. Let's see what we got. Try to clean it up a little bit.
Alright, I think I'm going to quit there. Alright. Got this snip, then we got that snip, then those little snips down here. That ain't going to work. Let's find us a snipping tool. Well, maybe. I'm just not winning on the snipping ammo. Maybe one day you will. Alright. Let's see how bad we did. And what we're going to do next on it. When I think material so I'm used to working with sheets so we can do this don't work one way try it another See how I turned it, how I was turning it with that in. Because well, that's the end that it would allow me to. The other end wouldn't. Alright. So, now then. What I think I'm going to do now. Is play with it. Oh, look. I, I got, got it finally. Yay. <laughs> okay. So, now then. Let's fix this with the ironing pins. Ah, so we can iron this bad baby down. And then we'll see what we want to do from there after we get back. I'm going to iron this down. Get it there. Why do you want to do that? I don't want you to do that. Okay? Don't do that. Got same, uh, the fold right down the middle of it. <laughs> so now we know where our mitle is. It's undeniable. Alright. Now then, I am happy with that, I think. Alright, what do I want to do? I am going to go think, and then we'll be back. Do you think I've fought long enough? <laughs> Alright, now, let's see. Let's take and... Now, when I go, next time I go to the machine, I'm going to sew all the way around. Okay? So let's take this thing, turn it in half. Okay, now we're going to turn our lip down, and I think it's beautiful, just beautiful. Now, we got our heart we want to put on here. I think that's going to look good, I hope. I wonder, no, I don't know, maybe I should put it on the back, right there. Okay, let's do this. Let's, let, let's do this. Let's play with it. Let's turn it around. I'm going to fold it from here to here. Pin it. That's the best way to go about didn't it? Oh, well, no. Let me get my fold right. Here to here. Fold it. Now we're going to pin it. Uh, 
gonna see. Let's do this. Let's get us some marks going. Piece of chalk. Let's get us some marks going. And that way, we know what we're going to do. Alright. Let me get a smaller one. I don't want that big old thing. Okay. So, from this line over, yeah, let's mark it right there. Alright, which that's two inches. So let's go two inches on this one too. Mark it. Okay. Now then, I've got nothing to go by here. Yeah, one, I'm like, I'll buy it. <laughs> Let's go two inches here. Two inches here. I've got them on both sides. So we're going to fold from this one to this one. Pretty well much more had it, I think. I don't know. Okay. Let's do this one and this one. Those little ones help me figure this one out. Alright, now let's fold this one and this one. And fold this one and this one. Now then, we have that. See what that looks like. All right. Now we don't want this sticking out. So what are we going to do there? This needs to be brought in right here. So maybe this is wrong. Okay. Maybe I need to do it different. Let's do it from here to here to this one. Ta -da! Now let's pin it. <coughs> Alright, now let's do it from this one to this one. This one, da -da 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 -da. To this one, see how that works out though. <laughs> I wish I'd have went with that a smaller heart. With that smaller heart. Alright. Let's turn it over. That would take our handle, any of our handles away. Now that's just not kosher. I think I'm going to put it right there anyway. I think I will. Just put it right there anyway. And hope for the best. So, I, I, want, I don't want it on my seam down here. So, just lay that across that knot. Lay it right there. Right in the middle there. I think that will work. So I'm going to sew this down from right here to right here. 
all the way around and it will overstitch this but it will make this right in here stronger so we have that done and I'm going to stitch all the way around it too so I'll be back wow that turned out pretty good I even let me tell you I even changed the thread to red at the top and it's yellow on the back so now that I'm amused at myself with that that works good I mean it's not you know maybe I should have went more maybe I should have went up to here the looks of it ooh yeah I think so I really do I think that would help that a lot so let's go back I'm going to sew it with yellow thread because I already got yellow on there <laughs> alright I can't believe it I did it right on top of the other stitch can I tell you how I've done it I went really really slow so that's how I did that now we need to worry about pockets our pockets will not be on this part it will only be on this part so now I think I would like to have my pockets I wonder if that I think that's going to be too big okay uh, this and I think I'm going to put a button there. I think it's what I'm going to do. Okay. So, now then, this right here is going to be the bottom of our bag. So, I'm going to pin this one down right here. <coughs> and this one down right here, just to check it, just take a gander at it. That is way too long. I think we all will agree that it's way too long. So, let's open this up. Let's take these out. Let's pull it up. Let's go right here. I think I want it right here to right here here to here. I'm going to pin it right here. Pin it right here. Go over and pin it. Nope. Stop. Hold the phone. Let's not let's not take that collect call. Alright. Da -da -da. Now, let's check that out. Okay, I'm going to have to add more on this because this is not going to be big enough. But we can get a, a general idea of what it's going to look like. And I'm thinking about taking putting a little pocket right here. Now, let's turn it over. Let's fold this up. Okay, we see a problem right here. That, that right there can't go. Can't go. Okay. But, however, I can make this. Let's try this again. Oh, Sandy. What you get yourself into sometimes. Don't know why you do that. Well, I like to have fun. Yep, you like to have fun. Okay. We'll put it all the way up there. We'll put that all the way up there. Now, yeah. turn it over. Turn it up. Turn it down. See, we got it clear. We got to keep that clear. And then there's our strap. Now we have to make sure we sew it 
all the way right here. Right here is where we need to sew it. How about instead of doing that, how about if I take and go right here. I want this level. And right here. Now let's see how that coincides to what we want. Flip. Flop. Drop. I think that's it. I think that's it. <laughs> okay. We'll be back in a minute. 